this is my analysis of Their Eyes But Watching God. This book was about a girl named Jane. She was African American and this told about her hardships back in the day with segregation and when they were just freed from being slaves. She wanted to find what she was, like what was her purpose in life. And she really thought about was love basically. And her idea of love in the beginning was pretty pretty bad. That she could just find love over time by just marrying somebody. That proved to be wrong by her failed two marriages. So she did eventually find someone named Tea Cake and they did form a good bond and she did dearly love him other than um, Jane other, other than her other husbands she's gone through a lot in her life she's gone on she had quite a bit of a life being abused by her second husband Joe who would abuse her every day, treating her like an object, not like a person, because back then women were treated like objects. And no one, and I guess that's how pretty much every man treated women, except T. Cake. He was actually a legit guy, except there was one time he did like hit her, but it was just. To show out in public that she was do he was dominant of her, and no so no one could take her. He was jealous, and Jane did get jealous. Of tea cake at one point, showing that she kind of feels that same way of dominance. I guess both of them could feel dominance over the other. They don't want to, and sh and everyone should just be equal book and that's what she's trying to tell us everyone is equal no one is should be dominant over the other one her, na her nanny tried to protect Jane from everything in the world and she was kind of wrong for doing that just because she did need to be exposed to segregation and need to find her own love she had to do that herself, and Nanny was just protecting her away from everything. She needed to know this so she could survive in the world. So that was my analysis of the rise of watching God.